And uh, as we got off the elevator on the floor, and I saw Ron go striding into Dad's room and then come out with his arms up like that, as though someone had pushed him back. And uh, when we went into the room, uh, I don't really, I mean, Dad, you know, his hands were on his chest, and, uh, and he was gone, and Uncle Roy was standing at the foot of his bed, and uh, he was massaging one of Dad's feet, just kind of caressing it, and he was talking to him, you know. And I don't know, it sounded like something like, well, kid, this is the end, I guess, you know, and that sort of thing. And, uh, and I saw his love, as I've never seen it before. It was 9.30 a.m. on December 15th, just 10 days after his 65th birthday. I cried in my wife's lap. <laughs> it put an end to a marvelous era. And, and I lay awake all night long. I couldn't sleep, trying to think what's going to happen next. They announced Walt's passing, and uh, then they cut in Julie London's voice, and she sang the Mickey Mouse Club song. Uh, M I C K E Y M O U S A. <sighs> I had to pull off the road because my tears were blinding my ability to drive. The news of his death revealed his immense role in the shaping of 20th century entertainment. Just an ordinary man with the most extraordinary talent of making you feel that you were important, where in actual fact he was the one. This was a man that had one foot in the past because he loved the nostalgia and used it in many uh, motion pictures and television shows to get through to the public. And one foot in the future because he loved the technology. You put him, you drop him in a, a glass of water and like a Japanese flower, he is expands in all directions. Huh? So it's the expansive Disney that's moved out in the world in so many different ways and has done nothing but good. I mean, here is a man who had scant education. You know, his parents were not exceptional people except in their character. He was not much of an artist. But somewhere came this, uh, this amazing factor of knowing what drama and comedy was. And so I'm afraid we're just going to have to say, well, Walt Disney, genius, period. Art means a lot to me in that something will never be finished, something that I can keep developing, keep plussing and adding to. It's a live, it'll be a live, breathing thing that will need changes. The thing will get more beautiful every year.